I can't like move forward. It's over. What up, y'all? This your boy Ace here. Welcome to Afternoon's Delight. So, um, yeah, this was this was a, a crazy. This has been a crazy finale so far, and um, I don't know what's gonna happen, man. But let, let's uh, let's uh, let's just try to see what's going on here. But let's talk about Avon and Rachel. We know that that is wrapped up. Um, we know that uh, uh, Rachel broke up with uh, Avon, and a lot of it had to do with. Um, him not wanting to engage uh, with Rachel just yet. And I'll get my thoughts on that in a second, but that's basically what happened. Uh, Rachel was ready to be engaged. He wasn't, so they weren't on the same timetable with that. And uh, that's the reason why she broke up. And, and kind of because she wasn't the first one to find out that he wasn't ready to be engaged. So it kind of was like a secret type thing where Ava did reveal it to her family and friends, but did not reveal it to her. So, um, and she was hurt by that and they ended up breaking up. Uh, it didn't happen. Well, she kind of, she confronted him about it after they met with her uh, parents on the bridge. They were talking about it and everything. And she showed her hurt. And then she showed even more hurt when she went to go see him at his hotel and uh that's where she officially broke up with him at he was devastated um uh i think it caught him off guard and uh she was very sad about it because she really did love avon and she really wanted to be with avon and she probably was going to choose him over frank uh tino i think she was going to choose him over tino but he wasn't ready to be engaged and uh that's the sad thing about it though because um they weren't on the same timeline. So let me say this. I kind of, especially being a man in this situation, I kind of definitely uh, relate a little bit more to Avon's side of it, where I think that he was in the right. He didn't. I think his whole thing was to, um, I think because of the Tino factor, knowing that Tino was still in play here, he probably just didn't feel like, you know, he didn't know if Rachel, you know, wanted to just be with him just yet. And he had some trepidations about that. And he might have just not been ready yet to be engaged. I know a lot of guys, they get cold feet at the last minute. And it's very understandable. I probably would have did the same thing if I was in his shoes. I do think he was very genuine, though, because you could tell his um, Rachel's friends were actually defending Avon. They were actually defending Avon um, to Rachel in front of her face that, he seemed like he was genuine. He told the truth, but he just didn't tell her, which was the bad part. That was, that was where he messed up at. He should have told her before, he, you know, uh, he even met her family. And um, and he just wanted to take things slow, um, which was the right angle for him. Um, and I see that going on. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to actually talk about Eric next. I don't know too much about this situation, but... Uh, I want to talk about that next because he said he still wanted to just I think a lot of guys are just They're kind of like man, dude I don't know if I wanted to get engaged with you that fast just yet And obviously this is something that Rachel wanted and I think Rachel was making a mistake by wanting either guy to just engage to her I think she should take her time and wait Wait a little bit longer like Avon wanted her to do And stuff like that Um and I heard things didn't work out between her and Tino. So what Rachel needs to do is she needs to go and contact Avon. And in my opinion, go work it out with Avon. And don't worry about being engaged yet. Get a chance to learn Avon a little bit more. And, you know, especially if he's not with anybody right now. Your family seems to like him. I think your friend, I think her friends really started to trust Avon when he told them about that because that was a big secret that he didn't even have to tell them. He could have continued to just lie in Rachel's face and just um, not even told her until the last minute that I didn't want to get engaged. But I think he was going to tell Rachel, but it's just that his, I think he felt like he wanted to just be honest with the family first. And maybe he didn't have a chance to really tell her just yet because I think because they were having, he was going to meet the family. He felt like, man, this probably ain't the right time to tell her. Just, yeah, I'll probably have to go tell her after. But I'm, I'm still going to tell the family about it. So, if she's still really that into Tino, I think Rachel should go on ahead and contact Avon. 
because um, they were live tonight. I think they should talk and say, look, let's let's go on a dinner and let's talk this through because I still feel like there's something there. And if, if the only thing that came between them is that he didn't want to get engaged yet, I think it could definitely be worked out, like definitely could be worked out. She would just have to be, I think she's rushing things a little bit and that might be the problem. Um, and this is why Tino's parents were concerned. See, it validates Tino's parents now, you know, um, them feeling like, you know, is this just about you wanting to get married and not about you being with a guy for a long time? Like, there's some things that I'm seeing, man. Um, go ahead and get this video a like, man. Hit the like button. Share the video. Subscribe to the channel, especially if you're new in the zoo. Any comments you got, uh, definitely put them below. And if you want to donate to the channel, hit the super thanks button below. I much appreciate it, y'all. But, um, yeah, I'm, I'm seeing some of the cracks with Rachel, man. And she has to learn how to take things slow. She's not that old herself. See, she's like 26 or 27. So I think she's going to learn eventually taking slow is the better route. And I think the show puts so much pressure on them to get engaged so fast um, that that's all Rachel was really thinking about was just getting engaged with somebody. Who's going to be engaged with me? Um, now you don't have to worry about that. I think you should take things slow and get a chance to re know Avon and explore that you know i hope they do but it usually don't work out like that when they break up with somebody on the show so um but if it happens i think it's a good thing for them man because i definitely see something there between them but uh thank you guys for watching after news delight